hey y'all i am back with a cvs shopping trip um i went to cvs yesterday on april 17th 2016 however i am recording today on the 18th because i had to get my um situation straightened out after what happened yesterday um so anyways everybody know about the scott tissue it's on sale for $4.99 and there's a $2 um, in-app coupon. Then also after the dollar off manufacturer coupon makes these $1.99 and then you submit your receipt to check out 51 and get a dollar back making these just 99 cents. And then also the Ajax is on sale for 88 cents or the 39 cent CVS coupon that printed out. And then there's also a 25 cent manufacturer coupon that came in this Sunday's insert making these just 27 cents. Okay, so now, anyways, on to what I'm going to talk to you about. I have come to the conclusion that I believe, like, my CVS is is like a hater when it comes to using CVS coupons, okay? Because I'm always having issues with these red box coupons. Okay, now, I have this $10 off of 40 any facial care purchase. Um, coupon okay so my plan was to go in there and pick up the Neutrogena products because I have acne prone skin and I wanted to purchase these items okay because I just you know as a couponer I want to get things that I know that I'm going to use and not just have sitting around collecting dust okay so I wanted the oil free acne wash this is the pink grapefruit line um, I have never tried the pink grapefruit line so I'm going to try this one out um, the oil free acne wash it's regular shelf price at let's see it's what six dollars well no the the astringent is six dollars and seventy nine cents and then the um, acne wash is eight dollars and forty nine cents and then the facial scrub here in the middle is ten dollars and ninety nine cents and then the um, wipes over here are eight dollars and ninety nine cents and then I did also pick up three of the yes two these are the um it's not even one of freaking focus um these are the cleansing wipes the yes two coconut ones picked up three of those for six forty nine each okay so with these um acne cleansing products and these facial cleanser wipes these got up to 50 54 dollars and 73 cents okay so i'm well over the 40 dollar mark to use this coupon right okay so the coupons that i use on these cleansers i just had the neutrogena coupons i had two of the two dollar off two manufactured coupons and then i used the two dollar in-app coupon from CBS, right? Okay, so get to the cash register and everything is scanning just fine. So I thought, right? No, it wasn't scanning just right because everything was going through except that $10 off of 40 coupon. So like she had hit total and everything and she was like, okay, well your total is 40 something dollars or whatever. And I'm like, $40? I'm like my total is not it's not even supposed to be nowhere near forty dollars you know I'm like something ain't right so you know she looks at the screen and then she turns the screen around to me and she starts scrolling up and everything that was in the red she was like well you know we can't override what's in the red so I'm like well what's in the red I'm like well did it take off my ten dollar off of any facial care purchase um and she was like no I didn't take off the ten off of forty I'm like well why not I'm still at the forty dollar limit I'm like, you know, I'm still well over that. And she's like, well, if it's in the red, we can't override it. I'm like, what you mean you can't override it? I'm like, you're looking at it, it looking at this right here. So then she goes to looking at these little four digits down here, you know, and it's showing that um, my car number ending in 4903. And I was like, okay, well, that's my car number. And she's like, well, it has a, you know, well, your car that you're scanning has a two at the end of it. And I'm like, it's always been like that, you know? So I'm, you know, I'm like at this point, like I'm really getting upset because I'm like, you know, trying to figure out why they're not accepting this coupon, 
you know so then the other lady comes up there and i was like ma'am i was like can you please try to figure out what's going on with this cash register i'm like i have spent over 50 dollars worth of these products and this coupon is not wanting to scan so she looks at it and you know she she couldn't figure out anything she's like well all i can do is call you know so she called the customer care or whoever she called she was back there about 25 minutes 30 minutes or whatever so she comes back and she's like, well, you know, he said that he, you know, we're not allowed to override the coupon. If it's not in the, if it's in the red, we can't, you know, push it through, you know. So then all of a sudden, you know, she taps on the computer screen and the, and the screen just start deducting stuff. I mean, it just started like, I mean, it went down from $40 to, you know, $17 and 51 cent. I'm like, okay, what just happened? She was like, I don't know what happened. You know, we all looking at this cash register like, okay, what happened? It just went from forty some dollars all the way down to seven dollars, seventeen dollars and fifty one cent. At this point, I'm like, you know what? I'm just gonna scan my card, my bank card, and get the heck on up out of here. And I will call, you know, CVS, you know, in the morning, which is today. So, anyways, so here is the receipt, and it's it's not even gonna focus for you, but um. You see the $2 coupons up here at the top. Those were my Neutrogena, Neutrogena coupons. The 25 cent coupon, that's the um, Ajax coupon. The $1 coupon is the Scott Tissue coupon. I had $22 in extra care bucks that I used. Yeah. Yeah, $22. Well, no, $28 in extra care bucks. I'm sorry. Yeah, I had $28 in extra care bucks that I used. And then um, right here is a $2 off of Neutrogena in-app coupon. I had a $2 Scott um, in-app coupon. And then $0.39 cent coupon is the um, Ajax. And then the 20% is the 20% coupon that I had. It took off $7.84. My subtotal was $15.12 plus tax was $17.51. Now, I had that... $10 coupon had it came off it would have been $5.12 right but hey that that was not the plan but I did get a $10 extra care book from purchasing $30 worth of the acne um the Neutrogena stuff but the yes to and did not work it wasn't in my area it was a spend 15 get five but it didn't generate a extra care book I didn't care about that don't worry I wasn't even concerned about it so anyway, I called customer care this morning and they are going to send me a $10 extra care book because they was like, well, we don't know why they didn't honor that coupon. And I'm like, I don't know why they didn't honor it either. You know, I was like, you know, this is like not the first time this has happened, you know, and I, to me, I feel as if like this store is trying to limit the coupons. I don't know if they have some kind of system where they're trying to, you know, keep couponers from spending less money at the register something is sneaky is going on with this store i know it is because this is not the only time this has happened to me you know it's like if you go in there and pay full price for everything everything is fine but then as soon as you start using coupons you know the computer system wants to do this funky thing and don't want to accept stuff and it wants to kick out coupons and then you don't know your true total until the very end you know, it's kind of like, you know, you're having to make sure the cashier is putting in the right stuff. You know, I mean, it's crazy. You know, it shouldn't even be that stressful at the register. But anyways, I just wanted to bring you all my experience at the CVS here in town. So thanks for watching and have a good day. Bye bye.